2016 Sprint Showdown, Chase Elliott has the faster car, Kyle Larson door slams him, Kyle Larson wins. 2016 Michigan, Chase Elliott screws up the restart, Kyle Larson wins. 2017 Michigan, Chase Elliott screws up the restart again, Kyle Larson wins. 2021 Kansas, Chase Elliott gets the track position, Kyle Larson decides not to help him on the restart, Kevin Harvick takes him three wide, Kyle Larson wins. 2022 Auto Club, Chase Elliott has the faster car, Kyle Larson door slams him with 20 to go, Kyle Larson wins. And then 2022 Watkins Glen, Chase Elliott has the better car the entire day, Kyle Larson on the final restart runs him up the racetrack, Kyle Larson wins. It is a tale as old as time, and honestly, if this happens again, it is 100% Chase Elliott's fault. Debate the morality of the final restart or not, Kyle Larson has a history of racing Chase Elliott aggressively for wins, nothing wrong with that, and Chase Elliott's going to have to realize Kyle Larson does not have his best interests, and he is going to have to change things up when he races Kyle Larson in order to avoid regret in November.